hey guys welcome to my channel so i haven't done one of these videos in so long because it's too much to edit and all that other stuff so we're gonna go ahead and do this one live so this is a palatable packs box that i received today um if you're not familiar with palatable packs they are a art subscription box um i believe the price is 34 or 35 dollars a month and you will receive a box this is the premier box so it's the biggest biggest box you can get and they'll send you some art supplies for you to uh, play with. Um, these are great for like beginners or people who just love to collect art supplies. So, like I said, this is April's box. It just came in today. I did get an email saying that if they won't show a card with what er everything that's in there. That we will have to look online. So, hopefully, I won't need to do that. But let's go ahead and open this box. Oh, what do we have? Okay, so right away I see Opaque Acrylics, Neo Opaque by Jacquard. Don't spray anymore, baby. And I'm going to go ahead and wipe this stuff down, guys, because I just can't be too careful. Oh, wow, so it's a big set here. Hollow and jewel color. Nine gorgeous metallic and pearlescent colors. Ooh, this is nice. So, guys, look at this set. Look at that. You can see, like, this has, like, gold glitter or, like, you know, a pearlescent color to it. Pink gold, halo blue gold, violet gold, pearlescent turquoise, pearlescent emeralds, pearlescent magenta, metallic what do you re reset pewter and sunset gold so let me go ahead and wipe this down we have a paintbrush and guys they always send bomb paintbrushes this one's nice this is a filbert robert simmons size 12 brush look at how nice and soft that looks I'm going to have to wash my hands. I've got a Posca pen. I hope that this is like a, a sub three millimeter. I hope it's smaller than the ones that I have. They also send a white one. A one millimeter. Nice. This is going to be a nice addition to my collection. They send, They always send like some type of surface for you to create on. So this is a four by five canvas panel. Stratmore, they always send some really good paper. Black mixed media paper, okay, cool, because I don't have it. And it's a vellum finish, vellum surface it says. 15 sheets in this little packet. Really great quality paper, and it is a size six by eight. So, guys, I'm telling you right now, this video is probably going to be long because I'm going to draw live with you guys. And I haven't drawn in so long, so I'm a little rusty. And then it comes with this little black 3x3 three three mini canvas. All right, so that's everything that's in this box. Let me get rid of this. Let me wash my hands really quick. I'm filming in my kitchen, guys, because there is no room in my art room right now. And it's either I do this or it doesn't get done. Nice. So I really like to um swatch the colors out. And I'm definitely going to have to swatch these out because these colors look bomb. Maybe we'll do something small on one of these little panels. I don't know. Let me zoom in. So for $35, I think that this box is well worth the money. I don't own any of these. Um, I do own Posca pens and you know paper, but I do not have any black mixed media. 
paper and it looks like really good quality it's really thick you can never have too many paint pens I love that they included a black this brush looks really nice I'm gonna need you guys to give me a oh it comes with a white one too let's open this pack I need a um my vase, my cup, you know, for water. Let me try to get this open. See, this is why I pre-record these. So it doesn't take so long. Okay, this opened up easily. Okay. So it's a light bodied paint, super soft feel on untreated fabric, leather, silk, paper, and wood. So you can actually use this to paint on clothes or fabrics. Na apply on natural and synthetic fibers, leather, wood, canvas, clay, and paper. All right, so these are all the colors that come that are are available. There's 33 colors that are available in this line. Look at these are nice. Let's not waste no time and get into it. Hey, Natalie, how are you? Sorry, guys, this isn't a crafty video. We're going to do an art video tonight. Let me get a paper towel, baby. I got my little helpers here. They think they're slick because they're really supposed to be punished right now. And they're trying to sneak over here and, you know, help me and stuff. All right. So we'll go ahead and swatch all of these. And then we'll create something. So Sunset Gold. Oh, cool. So I love this applicator. Look at that little fine tip applicator. So you don't waste too much. Look at that color, wow. That's gorgeous. You guys know I'm obsessed with gold. Okay, so let me go ahead and whenever you get these brushes guys and they're like extra hard, it's because they put something on it to protect the bristles. All you have to do is clean it off with some water and it'll be nice and soft. So let's open up this Posca pen because I want to write the names so I can have the swatches. It's always good to swatch out your supplies so you can have a reference to how certain colors look. Thank you. So I want to do it really, I want to make it really opaque there. Oh, wow. Look at this. This is a nice finish. I like these paints, guys. I've never heard of these. So that's how it looks on black paper. So the name of this one is... And with these Posca pens, you have to kind of... Push it down so all that paint can come down. Since it's brand new. There we go. So what did I say that was? Sun set gold. And then next we have... Come on, baby, don't mix them up. Then we have pewter, which is typically like a silver, so like a dark gray silver color. And this is how it looks straight out of the box. Really pretty. 
I don't want to put too much water on this brush. Oh, that's nice. These are really nice. And even though they're like, what did they say they were? What does it say on the package again? Let me see. Yeah, they are pretty creamy. And they're very opaque. I thought that they would be... They're light-bodied paints. So look at that. Very opaque. You can't really see the paper under there, especially with that being black. You know, you see like right here, I laid it on really thick and didn't really... You can kind of see through it. Wow, that's nice. Pewter. What should we draw, guys? What should I draw? We're not going to use all these colors. These are too many colors. A gold Easter bunny. This one is metallic reset. Look at how pretty. Really nice. And then, of course, these will, you know, act different on different surfaces. It dries really fast. All right, so that one is metallic reset. All right, and then next we have pearlescent magenta. I already know it's gonna be a nice color. And I didn't even shake these up, so for them to come out like that. I'm so happy with this box. I have not opened, I have so many of these boxes, guys, that I have not even opened because I have not been drawing or painting like I should be. I just want to show you how it comes out from the bottle. I didn't put much on this one. Let me put a little bit more. This one seems more watery than the other ones. Really pretty. So these are all metallic and pearlescent colors. What did I say the name of that one was? Oh, I love this Posca pen, this fine tip. This is the one millimeter. I need to get more of these. Huh? Then we have pearlescent emeralds. I'm going to shake these up. You should always shake your stuff up. Unless it says not to. Because, you know, sometimes they're just sitting. And all that stuff goes to the bottom. So this one is pearlescent emeralds. Look at how pretty that is out the bottle. Very pearlescent. Wow. Very beautiful. I think I'm going to draw a flower. I know I'm spelling this wrong. <laughs> okay. And then we have, oh wow, look at this color. Pearlescent turquoise. But yeah, guys, I've been getting these Palafull Packs boxes. I'm still subscribed to them. I get one every single month. Even though I haven't been drawing and stuff, I just can't bring myself to cancel. Even though I really should. Look at how beautiful this color is. Wow. That's gorgeous. I put a lot of water. There's a lot of water left in my brush right here.
Hey, Emily, how are you? Sorry, guys, the chat wasn't popping up. Pearlescent turquoise. So I'm just going to put P turquoise. Instead of writing all that out. But yeah, I love to do this when... I know, I'm late. I'm always late. <laughs> My lives are always random. I can't stick to a schedule. Halo Violet Gold. But the reason why they're always late is because of my kids. Right now, my son is down. And he's like the main one that makes the most noise. Like, I can't record with him. Thank you. Hey, Jasmine. How are you? Violet Gold. Oh, this one's a hollow. Let me write this down. Hollow Violet Gold. That sounds so nice. So this is how it looks out the bottle. So this is the art subscription box that I get. And these are, what do they mark them as? Light bodied paints. So it says, you can really see the gold. It's kind of hard to see the purple. Hmm. That's an interesting color. That's why it's always good to swatch these out guys because Look at how it looks from the bottle, and then look at how it looks on black paper. And of course, it will look different on white paper. So these are metallic and pearlescent paints that you can use on different surfaces. Paint your belly bougie. Yeah, right. <laughs> now we got jokes, huh? <laughs> Hollow blue golds. My belly's too damn big to put on this live. Oh, that's so nice. I really want to swatch these out on white paper. Oh, wow. Look at that. It looks more green than blue. Again, it's going to look different on white paper. Look at that. What is that one called again? Hello, gold. Um, I'm surprised they didn't send a finer brush for these. They sent these tiny canvases and then with a big old size 12 brush. They should have sent a smaller one for details. Okay. Then we have hollow pink golds. How many do I have left? Zero. Is the last one? Mm -hmm. Seems like more. This one's coming out watery. Um, let's see how it swatches out. Looks more orange than. So the gold is real prominent in these. So these are the pearlescent ones. And then these are the hollow ones. I like the pearlescent ones. They're all really beautiful though. All right, and then of course we have the black and the white. So let's see what we're going to draw. Talk to me, ladies. What are you doing? What are you up to tonight? Are any Do any of you draw or sketch? Thank you, Natalie. I think I like the pearlescent ones better. And look at, guys, look at that shine. Really nice. So let's see. I should have had something ready. I'm in bed. It's going to be midnight, but I can't sleep. Oh, it's midnight there? I think it's like 10 here. I'm about to go crazy. Can't go out anywhere. I know. I'm going through it too. Like, I just want to go outside. I don't know what's been going on in Chicago, guys. Like, we've been having this fog... Um, only on certain areas. 
No, I wish, Jasmine. They need to be giving me some kind of code. code. But if you guys are interested in signing up, you just go to Palafull Packs. Look on the website. And every month it'll be different different mediums and all that. Um, so it's really hard drawing on black paper. It's not hard, but yeah, it is, you know, because if I draw with black, you won't really see it. I only draw cute faces on my donut or things like that. <laughs> Wish I could draw or paint. You can, if you practice, you can, trust me. Okay, so let me just pick a couple of colors. What did I do with that? Made that paper. Thank you, baby. We'll just paint a girl's face because I love painting girls. Um, I wouldn't really be. This is a really pretty like skin tone, even though it's supposed to be violet. I don't know. I'm gonna try to sketch with this white pen, and then I'll probably go over some stuff. No, I don't want to do that. I need a finer pen. I feel like they could have thrown in a little palette or something. I don't know. Um, let's do this pearlescent magenta. That's pretty. So I'm just gonna. A little bit here. It's going to be kind of hard to do. So bear with me, guys. I haven't drawn a painting in a long time. This is so pretty. I think that these will look better, like, if I was, like, blocking in some colors, you know, like, if I already had. Does that make sense? If I had something drawn in and I was just painting the colors in versus like mixing colors and blending them. Yes, yeah, not as good as you by any means. Oh, thank you, Jasmine. You're sweet. Let's open up this Posca pen. I know it's not going to show on here, but... Yeah, I need to have like some kind of outline. So I want to draw some eyes. And I'll probably paint over this, who cares? As long as I have something down. Oh, so I like how these Poxica pens can go over. That paint. That's nice. So it's kind of hard drawing on, on the dark paper. Because it's like you got to kind of go backwards with it. But I got to have some kind of guide for me. What do you guys think of this box? Do you think that it's worth the $35? I think so. I think that it came with a nice amount of paints and other materials as well. How in the world did you just do that? I just blinked. <laughs> You're silly. All right. So I could definitely use that black to go. It's so cool. I love to draw like eyes, guys. That's like my favorite thing. All right, and then she's got some eyebrows. Give her some brows. It would have been cool if they had Posca pens in these colors. And then we'll paint in hair and all that stuff. I just want to kind of get a 
Thank you. Emily, I can't draw to save my life. <laughs> I'm telling you guys can draw. My aunt, she's always been into art. And um, she's always been the type to say, oh, I can't draw. But she loved art. And so she would go to like art galleries and all that stuff. She was like really into art stuff, artistic stuff. And I got her to start drawing and she's so good now. So you guys can draw. It just really takes practice like with anything. So again, I'm just doing like a little rough outline so we could paint some of the stuff in. I couldn't do eyes like Lucy is doing. I can try. You can. All you gotta do is practice. You guys gotta let me know if you like videos like this. I used to always draw live and paint. But I haven't, I've been really into crafting. Crafting kind of took over. All right. Those eyes look janky. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but we'll fix it. Um. Let's do an outline on the face. So she's going to be very cartoony. Still cute though. Sit down, Maya. I got my kids here, girl, guys. Just in case you hear anything that's dumb in the background. So now I'm going to go ahead and grab these paints. Um, I'm going to use this pewter for, for the hair. <laughs> Emily, I'm like, who is Lucy? I didn't understand. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot. Oh, this is black. Okay, at least I will see how the black looks. So that's cool that they gave you a, gave us a white and a black because we can kind of mix it with the other colors. This stuff dries really fast, though. So I gotta try to work fast. I'm gonna try. I don't know. Guys, even if you don't draw, like you need to doodle. It's so relaxing. It is very, what's the word I'm looking for? It's very therapeutic. Yeah, I'm not liking this. But we're just gonna play with these, this and see. So I can get used to the supplies. So one thing's for sure is that these dry really fast. So you gotta work really fast with them. I can't even see that hair. Let me add some of this. All right, girls, cool it down. All 
I don't know. I want to do some of this in the eyes. It's also a little hard for you guys to see what I'm doing. Thank you, Emily. Looks like crap to me right now. But hopefully it'll come together. We'll see. I know she looks possessed right now, but don't worry. Hey, kitty cat. So this is a Palafull Pax unboxing. It's an art subscription box that I'm subscribed to. Um, it's the Premiere box, and they sent me a ton of paints. Um, these metallic and pearlescent colors. And... Some paint markers. They gave me this paper pad. This black paper pad that I'm working on. And a couple little canvases. Thank you. It looks crazy right now, but thank you. You guys are so sweet. So I'm kind of just playing with them. And seeing how they work. kind of hard um, drawing on black paper. Okay. Let me see if I can bring those eyes back. Because she's looking real zombie-ish. Oh, let's see how this white paint works. Use the white. Guys, are you doing any crafting? Or is everyone laying down? I know it's late. It's 11 o'clock here. Me too, Emily. I haven't been able to sleep. Yesterday, my son, he took a nap like around six, five or six-ish. And that boy, my, my son's four years old, by the way. And this kid stood up to about seven this morning. Thank you, Jasmine. We'll see how it comes out. I know, right? I'm ready to send my daughters to sleep. They think they're slick. But my son, he was up to like, what did I say, like five or six or seven? I don't even know. My husband got in really late. And he was still up. This looks crazy. <laughs> no, so I didn't get any. I slept a little bit. And I like my head started to hurt and I just felt so sick. And I know it was because I didn't get any rest at all. But I, um lately we've just been used to like sleeping in late. Like, I don't know, it's terrible. I don't have my kids on a schedule, which I know. I know. Good night, crafting. You going to bed, Jasmine? Or are you saying goodnight to Natalie? She's not going anywhere. She, I think she's telling me to uh, put my kids to bed.
So you see it's metallic, so... Let's do the lips. I really like this color. <laughs> Mine too, girl. I got big lips too. I know, guys. But I don't know. With this stuff going on, I'm not going to say that I'm scared because I'm not. But it's like, I don't know, you know, with all this stuff going, you just don't know what's going to happen. Like, and I live in Chicago and this could happen anywhere, but I don't know. I just, I feel like people might start acting crazy, you know, with there not being groceries in the stores and all that. And so it's just kind of hard for me to go to bed at night sometimes. I know that's terrible. So... I try to, I usually, I usually can't sleep anyway, so I'm usually up. But trust me, if I'm tired enough, I will knock out, like, especially being pregnant. I just doze off. <laughs> what month was your favorite, Poochie? Um, as far as, like, these boxes, I don't know. I've been in... I've been getting these for over maybe two years now. And I haven't been opening a lot of them. So I don't know what, what would be my favorite one. But every month they always send something cool. I don't like this. This one, though, has to be, like, the coolest one I received so far. Because everything else that I received, I, have like, basically have. You guys know how I'm, like, um, I'm always shopping that Tuesday morning for our, um, craft supplies and all that. So, before I was crafting, I was like that with art supplies. So, I own a lot of art supplies. You guys hear my birds? Leave them alone, baby. My mom got us got the kids um two parakeets and they're so beautiful guys and i thought that was the nicest thing for her to do especially during this time you know for the kids i know natalie said don't talk about tuesday morning she's gonna cry <laughs> i miss tuesday morning so much my husband does not understand Oh, I thought you said you were going to bed. I'm glad you stayed. See, it only looks good when you put it at a certain angle. Look at how much more opaque this paint pen is. I know, I haven't even been to Dollar Tree, really. I had to force myself to go that one day. Um, recently for my brother's birthday i need to go to walmart tomorrow to get like some more groceries that i need like i need potatoes and stuff like that to cook but honestly i don't want to go and my mom she's like i don't want you going anywhere tell me and i'll go get it but i can't do that i can't make my mom go for me put her at risk I'm going to kind of bring back some of these. It is very stressful. This is just a really stressful time. I know. Thank you, Jasmine. I've been doing really good, though, guys. Um, I work out on my treadmill. Like, I walk. I can't do too much because... I'm um, a high-risk pregnancy, and I'm on, like, pelvic rest. And if I do too much, I'll start having, like, really intense contractions. So my body lets me know. The baby lets me know when I'm doing too much. But I try to get on there. 
as much as I can. Get a little bit of workout, working out in. I've been eating really well. I've been trying not to like eat a lot of certain things. Like they um diagnosed me with gestational diabetes, which I've never had, guys, in any of my pregnancies. I don't know, this pregnancy is so different. It's been so stressful. But they had me like take checking my blood sugar and all that. Every, like four times a day. So I'm kind of learning. Like I'm not supposed to be eating a lot of carbs and stuff. So I got to cut down on the rice. And guys, I'm Puerto Rican. And you know how it is being Hispanic and not being able to eat rice. So if I do eat some, it has to be like a tiny bit. Yeah, thank you. But yeah, it's just been really stressful. And then on top of the, all of that, you know, this stuff happening. I don't know, guys. I've been reading so much stuff about, like, a lot of hospitals now with this pandemic going on. I'm reading that they won't let, um, they'll only let, like, one person in the delivery room with you. And some hospitals won't even let anyone be in the delivery room with you. So I'm kind of like, it had me a little like, oh, God, I hope that that doesn't happen, you know? So, and, you know, things are changing daily, so. It's just like, oh. Just craziness. Mm, can you see that black? Yeah, you can kind of see it, right? Let me see if I can kind of blend it. But yeah. It's just been stressful. I miss my job and everything, but I'm so happy that I don't have to work because it was so stressful for me. And I'm glad I could be home with my kids, you know? Thank you, Natalie. But I just wish it was under better circumstances, you know? It is what it is, though, guys. I should have left a little bit of that poking in there, poking out. Maybe I'll add it on top. I love drawing eyelashes. You can order online and pick it up so you don't have to go in the store. Yeah, but... <laughs> it's I, Yeah, I don't know. I haven't tried it. I know we're like with a lot of craft stores of a Club Nouveau cover album. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I just like, I don't want the people coming to my house. The Walmart I live by is ratchet. <laughs> Thank you, kitty cat. Guys, you got to you got to tell me your name, so I can call you by your name. Claudia, is that your name, um, kitty cat, Claudia? Okay, I'm gonna try to call you Claudia. I gotta remember that. But I have been enjoying um, ordering online from some stores, like crafty stores. But I'm trying my best not to. What really cool, really keeps getting me is Peachy Cheap, man. 
They keep coming out with these damn deals that are like, you know, you can't miss out on it. I won't, Jasmine. Thank you. But yeah, those are just some of the things that they're kind of going through my head sometimes. Oh, I like how that looks blended on there. Can you guys see that? I want to make her a skin tone. Let's, I'm going to try to do gold. I know I'm going to probably mess this up. But I'm going to go for it. Which one am I on? But I don't know about it anymore. What do you think? Yeah, Coco and Reno. I'm still subscribed to them. I think I'm going to do this color, baby. Give me the halo violet gold. Um, I'm subscribed to Coco and Reno. And at first, I love their dyes. I love when they came out with that rosette one. Um, the Christmas one was okay. And then I feel like there's just a lot of them that I got that I do not care for. Now, see what make, made you blend the lips like that. <laughs> Because, I, I don't know, I just want to give us a little bit of definition. But, yeah, the ones that I've been getting lately, I'm not happy with them at all. Like, I don't know if you guys noticed, I haven't showed a few of them on my channel. You can probably still order online. They actually had um a big sale, Claudia. Their dyes are probably really on sale now. Because, you know, with this happening, a lot of people... A lot of companies are losing sales because nobody's really shopping. So definitely look online because I know they do sell. This is nice. They will like sell them again. That one I really liked. I love the Halloween one. There was one they it was like a fall themed one. I didn't like that one. I didn't like these last ones at all. So I hope that the one that they sent out soon is going to be better. Because they're really cheap. They're a good price, though. You know, even though I don't like all of them, there's a few that, you know, you'll like or whatever. It's better you don't buy extra junk just because you see it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. stuff trying out quick when they charged me for this month there wasn't even a sneak peek they actually just showed one um natalie check your emails so from what i seen they're like little small ones and i hated the fact that you know it's cool like that they got they got these designers and they want to have them you know show and and buy the product but like with like for instance this powerful packs the subscription that i have i love that I don't know what the hell I'm going to get until I open the box. With Coco and Reno, everybody's posting what's the next die. It's not It's not any fun. Like, you know what I mean? I don't know. That's just my opinion. Those are just my thoughts on it. But again, it's a really good price. $12 a month. And then you always get at least. So the new one that's coming out. Natalie, it's supposedly it's supposed to be like really tiny dyes, and they're kind of cute. Like, I know there's there was a sunglass one. Um, they're like different. Yeah, isn't it? And it's a really nice skin tone. I like this color a lot. Sorry guys, I lose my train of thought thought quickly. What was I saying about the little ones? So they did show a sneak peek, and they said that there's over thirty dyes in this one. So, yeah. And again, for $12.99, like, I love dyes. So, yes, I saw that, but they didn't show before. They charged me. Yeah, they never do. Yeah, thank you, Jasmine. I think so, too. Hey, Miss Gata. What's your real name? I'm finally drawing, girl. It's so funny how this, like, it looks purple when you put it down, but when you paint with it, it's like a brown gold. I love this color. This is a beautiful color. So I really should have started with this. Janet, okay. I'm going to try to remember that.
Guys, you should follow her on Instagram. She's a really good artist as well. I know I haven't drawn it so long. Thank you, Mama. So this is the Palafo Packs box they sent me this month. They sent these really cool paints. And you can like, um, it says that you can use these on fabrics. I'm going to paint over this and go over with that black again. That looks so pretty now. See, look, I was scared to use this. Alexis, leave the birds alone. So we've only had the birds for like a week. And they're like, they get so freaked out. My kids, they just terrorize them. <laughs> you should paint. I'm telling you, painting and coloring and drawing and doodling is so relaxing. Very therapeutic. Guys, I like this color. This is beautiful color. I love this color. Look at how pretty. So it dries so fast that I can't get an even finish. You see how it's like kind of splotchy in some areas? Let me see. This color is beautiful. And you can kind of see the purple when you turn it a certain angle. I like that. I need to paint. I just use markers. You should paint. It's always good. That's what I like about this, this subscription box. Because they'll send you things that you would never buy or look at or think of. Hey, Soleil. So happy to catch you on my live, girl. I miss you. And guys, they always send all different kinds of different things. One year, one month they sent, um, they'll send color pencils, markers, oil paints. Um, what else did they send? One time they sent like a marbling kit. So, and then they have a smaller, like this is the premiere box. So you get a lot of supplies. This looks pretty so far. I'm going to keep working at it, guys. But uh, they have a smaller box. I think it's like $13 or $12. And I think they'll kind of like send you the same thing, but like less. So like maybe just like a few sheets of paper, a few, like one canvas, and a few of these colors versus like the entire pad, you know? So yeah. Thank you, Emily. I'm so happy you guys jumped on here with me. Usually when I do these videos, um, I pre-record them. Thank you, baby. So I'm just trying to f fill in these areas where you can kind of see the black under. I want to get a nice... Pretty even... Coverage. All right. She's starting to look cross eyed. Don't worry, we're gonna fix that. Girls, it's time to go to bed. For I need you guys to go lay down. Go lay down. I love you. Good night. Mm -hmm. I love you guys. Love you. Leave the link on your description box so I can tell my daughter. Okay, I will. I think so too, Jasmine. I love this color. Now, of course, it's going to look different on white paper, but this looks pretty nice on this black surface. <laughs> she kind of looks like a drag queen right now. But we're going to get her right. Okay. So now, these are the colors, guys, that are just joining. Thank you. Thank you, Soleil. I was saying how I haven't painted in a long time. I want to add a little bit of red to the lips. But I want some of that um, purple color too. So let's see. 
if we can kind of mix it. I know, right? These colors look good for makeup. It's okay if I paint over the black because the Posca pen will go over these paints. Everybody should own a Posca pen because they are bomb. You could even use those markers to um, the paint pens to like draw on phone cases, glass, all kinds of surfaces. They're really opaque. Let me add some more shadow. I know, right? But you know what I love about Palette for Packs? They did send me a free box one time to review on my channel. And I really liked it. So I just subscribed after that. So I don't know. Can you guys see that hint of red on the cheeks? She looks like a man right now. And I always have like a little reference picture on the side. Okay, let me see what we're going to do with her hair. Do you guys think that we should try a different color for the hair? Mm. Maybe we'll add a little bit more of this pink color to the hair. You gotta work really fast with this because this stuff dries quick. That's probably too much pink. But whatever, we gotta deal with it because I already put it down. We gotta work with it. But guys, I cannot wait until I can go on to Tuesday morning. <laughs> what are you guys, where's gonna, what's the first place that you're going to go after all this craziness is over with? We're changing her up. No, it's not me so late. <laughs> Kind of looks like me with the big lips, right? I don't know what, like, if this is just me, but self consciously, I always draw my girls with big lips. It's me, Zule, to see your parents. Dollar Tree on Tuesday morning. Do they live far from you, Janet? I said your name right, right? My daughter just said, you're very talented and your picture is gorgeous. Thank you, mama. Guys, my daughter, she can draw really good. I'm going to have to let her do a live one day. She's starting to, she's going to be better than me. She definitely is. Girls, my kids, they've been trying me all day. Almost two hours. Have you been FaceTiming? I'm so, I'm so happy and thankful for like FaceTime and technology, you know, so we can check on our loved ones and all that. I'm not going to lie. Like if there's one place that I'll go, it's my mama's house. Like I'm going to go to my mom's house. I try not to go over there, though. Thank you, Jasmine. Don't even know, girl. I know that I will wake up early and be out. 
all day. <laughs> Same, Natalie. I just hope this stuff is over with before my baby comes. Like, honestly, I'm doing July. And you guys know how Trump was saying, like, it's going to end soon, man. I don't believe that. I think that this stuff is going to be a while. I honestly, I really do. Okay, that's pretty. But we're going to have to bring... Yeah, I'm so thankful for FaceTime. And social media. I'm definitely thankful for that. To see my mom and sister in Chula Vista. This is the longest it's been since I've seen them. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's the first time I'm coming. I'm going to miss my sister's birthday on the 7th. Oh. Well, just thank God that they're alive and well. And you can see her, you know, on... um. Through technology or something. My brother's birthday just passed. My daughter's birthday is April 27th. So I already told her, you know, there might be a possibility that we won't be able to do much for your birthday. Yes, it's definitely saving me money, girl. <laughs> it's crazy that, you know, you got some money in your pocket and you don't even know what to do with it. That is funny, Jasmine. Yes, I miss going to the movies, too. I miss going out to eat, period. I love to go out and sit with my family and eat. Especially if it means I don't have to cook. Because I get tired of cooking. I try FaceTiming every day, but it's not the same. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry, Claudia. Happy hour dating. Go ahead, Jasmine. Yes, they that they are all safe. You don't want to take anything to them. It's crazy. I know. And that's why I try to stay away. Because my mom, she lives like right up the street from me. She makes me, it makes me so upset when she goes anywhere. You know what's crazy, guys? Is, um, I don't know if you guys remember, I had did a video around my husband's birthday in the beginning of March. And we went to New York, and I had no idea what was going on, that the coronavirus was out there. It was everywhere, but, like, that they had so many cases, I had no clue. <laughs> I am going to buy toilet paper. We don't have any toilet paper here either. We don't have any hand sanitizer. We don't have any alcohol anywhere. It's crazy. So I like to do this to put the... Put it down and then kind of blend it with my finger a little bit. But I'm so thankful that, you know, that we we're okay and nothing happened. Because that was pretty risky. Like, I did not know. If I would have known that they had cases like that, because it's, it's so bad right now over there. I'm, I'm really praying for them, for all of us. No, Ambo, we're going to hang out. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. Everything will go back to normal soon. Hopefully sooner than later. So these paints are kind of... Right on my marker. Oh, Jasmine, three weeks. My daughter, too, she's April 27th. I'm ruining these markers. So you gotta kind of like pump them to get that pink going. I love to draw cat eyes, big lips, and lashes on my girls. The 18th is your birthday. Oh, Emily, your daughter's is the 26th. My daughter's is the 27th. We just got to make it special, guys, somehow in our own way, you know? Cause still, it could still, you could still celebrate.
We're going to have to figure out what to do for her. I asked her what she wants. She said, I just want some cake and to play Fortnite all day. <laughs> now I really said I hate Corona. I'm changing the Modelo. <laughs> I'm changing to Modelo. I know I'm getting tired of eating my food too. But guys, I was spending too much damn money eating out. So I'm kind of happy to to eat better and all that. But I'm so sick of cooking. My husband, he does not cook. And it's so frustrating. I'm like, man, go make me a sandwich or something. No more Coronas at home. <laughs> Let's draw her some lower lashes. This came together pretty nicely, guys, considering what it was looking like before. Yes, extra cooking, extra dishes. I don't trust going out like to eat even to the drive through. Even though they have pickup and all that. Doesn't that suck, Emily? See, and my husband, he can cook. My husband, he's he's still working, guys. So it is I hate that he has to work. You know, I'm thankful. But I hate that he has to take those risks, you know what I mean? And he just he's so fine with it. He doesn't mind going out, you know, because he wants to provide for us. What did you say, Sole? Let me see. Oh, the dishes, yes. But yeah, it's really... I'm like on the edge when he... Like at first, they, they laid off a lot of people from his job, over a hundred and something people. And he was so grateful that he wasn't one of them. But low-key, I was kind of like, man, I wish they did so we can apply for unemployment or something. You could be home safe. Sometimes money's not everything. Yeah, see, and mine works for um, a factory type of place, too. But I don't know, guys, everything, I, I'm a true believer of everything happens for a reason. You know? Sometimes we don't understand the reason why at first. Okay, girl, come through. She's coming together a little bit. That was kind of like, was like, what's the point of using black paper if I was just going to cover it and go over it in black? But whatever. I need this to come out how I want it to come out. Ooh, that was a lot of paint. I'm going to try to rub it in nicely. Thank you. But yeah, guys, we just got to stay prayed up now more than ever. For real. Because there's some things that we just can't control, you know? And what's going to happen is going to happen, you know? I'm going over this too much right here. Let me leave it alone. My light's starting to go out, guys, a little bit. It's getting dark. Thank you, Mama. Amazing how the picture is coming together. Thank you, Jasmine. Let me see if I can put on... phone flashy there we go let's take this one down 
It's my little light. Just kind of looking at my reference picture. Let's work on her lips. I want to add a little bit of shading on the lips. Guys, I want to get a dog so bad. <laughs> And I'm out of my mind because I got a baby coming. I already have three kids and two birds and a husband. You know, the husbands, they're like an extra child. I'm off to feed afternoon snack here. Bye, Soleil. Thanks for stopping in. Thank you, Claudia. But I, I kind of just want a dog so bad. I feel like this is the perfect time to get a dog. I'm crazy, right? I feel so good to draw again. Back in November, my husband got me an iPad and um the Apple Pencil. I can't be home without my fur babies. I know I want one so bad. You have three. Oh, my God. We had like a big pit bull. And I love pit bulls, but we didn't have him as a baby, and we had to get rid of him when we moved. And I couldn't walk that dog. That dog walked me. But my husband's like, we don't need no dog, but I really want one. I think this is the perfect time. But I know I don't need one with the baby coming. So I don't know. We'll see. Aw. I don't like that. Let me see if I could use some water and clean it off. Nope. And I want two birds and a goat. A goat? My husband said maybe I'll get a goat for my birthday in June. I can't wait. That's so awesome. Jeanette, you have three dogs too? What kind of dogs? Emily, you got to convince him, girl. You got to put that... Poke that the lips out, girl. Like, please. I don't know. I think it's a perfect time to get a dog. They give you a sense of security. They're so loving. Where were you going to go from? Did I sell them at the pet store there? Let me add a little bit of highlights. Let's do a little bit here. Could barely see that. I love this one millimeter Posca pen. He won't because he spent 20,000 on his dog that was sick and he said never again. Oh wow. Jasmine said, Don't do it. <laughs> I want a baby go too. <clears throat> Times like this, I wish that I lived in the country. Not a crowded city where people are like all on you and all that. Vet bills are not good. Yeah, I hear. You can foster to see if you like having a dog. That's a good idea. Two pit bulls and a husky. Oh, my God. I Those huskies are so beautiful. Those are the big, fluffy, Eskimo-looking dogs, right? 
I love pits. I don't want to overdo it. Those dogs are beautiful. When I was younger, the people upstairs from us used to have a brown one. Oh my God, it was so beautiful. Carla said, goats over here for $40. Where is this, in California? Pucci, I thought you were coming for dinner. <laughs> Girl, when I come to California, I will come to dinner. Don't play. I love to have somebody cook for me. Oh, Jersey. Really? Where the hell do you guys get goats from, Jersey? The pet store? They sell them at the pet store? She's so pretty. That's really low. We have fares and they sell them. That's awesome. I love pits too, but our house insurance won't cover us if I get a pit. Yeah. my And my pit bull, he was destructive, man. He did not like to be... Like I said, we didn't have him when he was a baby. He would like tear the house up. He, he When we lived in Mississippi, he tried to tear our door down. Like He was really strong. So I understand. But when you have them as puppies. Okay, rabbits, yeah. Chickens too. That's awesome. You can kind of train them when they're little, you know, to not do those kind of things. But yeah, sometimes they just get into all kind of stuff. Damn, I let this one dry out. I'm scared to. Okay. I don't want to like. I send you the $40, you mail me one. <laughs> My father just got a puppy. And I'm like, please send it to me. He's like, how the hell am I going to send it to you with the stuff going on? I was like, I don't know. Figure it out. I want that puppy. Okay, I messed it up. I shouldn't have did that. I'm trying to, like, rub it off before... Mm, I messed it up. Let me go over with that paint again. See, that's the only thing with drawing and art. Like, sometimes you don't know when enough is enough. You gotta learn when to stop. I forgot what color we used, guys, on the skin. It was this one, right? The violet? Yeah. Millie baby goats I want for. I have never thought about having a goat. All right. Cute. <laughs> Natalie, you want to go too, girl? But these birds, guys, we only had them for a week. They're terrified of me. It gets me, gets me so mad. <laughs> I try to pet them and stuff, and they run from me. And they, it's so funny. I have a miniature bossy pool, a miniature multi pool, and a white shepherd mix. Oh, those sound pretty. No, I'm good. <laughs> I'm trying to see what I should do with this hair, guys. Kind of don't want to mess with it. Three boxers. Oh, that's awesome. Those are those short, stocky dogs. Let's just do this. Boxers are beautiful dogs. I think tiny dogs, they're so cute, but I don't 
I'll do it there for me. There you go, Em. You can have a small goat delivery business. Em, you gonna make some money, girl? Everybody wants some goats now. Boxes are full energy. This is what I do with hair when I'm lazy and I just want to give it some little texture or something. They are and Poochie, they're big dogs. I don't know why I thought they were short and stocky. They mail chickens, so I guess I could mail a goat. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Came on nice so far, right, guys? Be honest, were you guys kind of like, oh, when I first started, like, oh, girl, what is that? Because I was kind of looking like, she started to look like Joanna, man. You guys ever seen that movie? These kids don't want to go to sleep for nothing. Thank you, Natalie. I hope I inspire you guys to draw. That'd be cool. Her head just floating in the air to make her neck. Okay, she kind of cute. I'm used to seeing my daughter draw, so I kind of knew what you were doing. I didn't know your daughter drew. Natalie should post some of her stuff. You said you draw, but I didn't know it was going to look like this. Thank you. I could have had a chicken. <laughs> Why you didn't tell me? I want to be like Selena and have a lot of farm animals. Okay, send it to me. How old is your daughter? Eighteen, wow. So I know she's probably really good. She's been drawing since she was five. Oh, wow. What does she like to draw, like portraits and stuff? A lot of people don't even think I draw because my Instagram is just like all crafty stuff now. But I have tattoos on there, paintings, drawings, all kinds of stuff. I think we're almost done, guys. Oh, I've been in here a long time already. Just add a little highlight here. I'm so rusty, guys. But this came out kind of cute. Thank you, Jasmine. You got to trust the process. She no longer draws pretty princesses. <laughs> now they're smoking. <laughs> that is funny. <laughs> oh. See, look, I'm doing too much. 
fix that. So I really like these paints. See, I would have never purchased any paints like this. So that's what's cool about these subscription boxes. They'll send you stuff that you, you know, never tried. Kind of scary. <laughs> she looks pretty good job. Thank you, Anna. Thank you for joining us. That's funny. You said she doesn't draw princess anymore. Now they're smoking. Let her express herself, girl. These white markers, these Posca pens, you can't get anywhere. You can order it online on Amazon. Um, I like to order from this art supply store called Dick Blick. They might. No, I don't think they have them at Michael's. Guys, tell me where you can find these. Janet. I know for sure you can go to like Dick Blick, any art supply store. Um, they have a lot of them on Amazon. But this is the one millimeter one, guys. I would really get this one as a finer point. I love Posca pens. I don't use them as much as I should. I don't like this right here. I'm going to paint this over. Because it's going to bother me. I got too much water in there. But definitely Amazon, I know you can find them. And Dick Blick, they, their prices are kind of the same as Amazon. But just type in um, Posca pins. And a lot of stars will come up. You're welcome, Claudia. All right, guys. That's it, I think. Let me add a little white in the hair. My phone's about to die. I'll finish your video later, Pucci. You too, Mama. Thank you for joining me. Stay safe. Thank you for joining me, Emily. Thank you. Good night, guys. Be safe. I'm just going to add a couple little white in here. And we're done. But yeah, guys, that's it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you give me a thumbs up if you did. And let me know what your thoughts are on this box. So this is the April box. And they send me so many paints. I really love this paintbrush. This paper is really nice. It's really thick. And look at the finish that these paints give on it. Really beautiful. Good night, Janet. So let me show you everything that came in the box in case you missed it. Um, so it came with this set of the metallic and pearlescent ones. There's six, nine colors. Then they gave me a black and a white one. Two Posca pens. One is a three millimeter black. Good night. And then this one is the white one millimeter they gave me two canvases to work on. This paintbrush is really bomb. I think I said that already. And then last but not least is this multimedia, the mixed media black Strapmore pad that has 15 sheets of black paper. So I think that it was well worth the $35. You guys let me know. I know I only used a couple colors, but these are the other colors in the set. Really beautiful. Oh. I don't have an answer. <laughs> Shut up, Siri. All right, guys. So that's it for this video. Make sure you thumbs up. I'll catch you guys next time. Everyone be safe. And I'll catch you in my next video. Bye. I love you guys.